Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Jessica the Dancing Avon Lady, and today we are trying out this. What is this? It is a youth activating massager. So apparently it's all the rage, and it's supposed to help to bright, not to brighten, it's supposed to help to stimulate circulation and help a promote absorption of your serum and also your other skincare products to hopefully revitalize my very tired skin. The reason why I bought this was because one night when I was up until about two in the morning breastfeeding my beautiful little boy, um, I was going through YouTube and I was watching a show from an episode from, I think it was like In Style, and there was this model who was raving about specifically the massage, um, massage the facial massagers and I was like huh so then I did a little googling on it and there was this other Japanese youtuber who used it for two weeks and he had really incredible results so I was like um let's give it a try so I ordered this from Avon uh, probably almost a month ago now definitely but way before Christmas I just I haven't had time to shoot this video actually yeah definitely before Christmas but I just haven't had time to try it out hopefully I can be consistent and try it out. But I want to give you a first impression first and then later on I'm going to do a two weeks later. Okay, so let's open up this baby. So the it is the Eclat Dior Youth Activating Massager by Avon and it looks interesting. <laughs> Leaving it at that. It looks interesting. Open it up. Oh, it's heavy. It's actually quite heavy. I put a bit of weight to it. And it's so shiny. What else is in here? Oh, cool. It's a structure area. Oh, this I didn't know. Okay, I never read instructions. I'm actually really bad about reading instructions. But when you open it up, it actually gives you a list of all the different places you can use this. So you could use it on your V line. What's a V line on? <laughs> or, well, I guess it's still kind of me. Mine's more of a U line than a V line. <laughs> Uh, you can use it on your cheek, your cheekbone area, your eye and your eyebrow area, your forehead and hairline area, your neck and dec decolette, decolette line, and acupressure for temples and back of your earlobes. There's more at the back. You can even use this for body care. That's so cool. So you can use it on your arm line and your chest line, your waistline, and your leg line. This thing can be used on your whole body. That's amazing. Cool beads. Okay. So, kind of shakes and rattles. So, this... <laughs> I can't... <gasps> All right. Just be mature. It, it looks like little bug eyes. It really does. It looks like little bug eyes. Like cartoon frog eyes. <laughs> so you want to roll the massage up and down, right and left of your faces and your body. The chrome plated face roller maximizes the cooling effect, which instantly helps to reduce puffiness and dullness of your face. It's easy to grip handle, which it is. It has a 73 degree ergonomically designed roller to glide on face smoothly. And you want to massage around the face after skincare to increase its efficacy. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I think so. Efficacy. So the effectiveness, essentially. There's a warning with this too. So you do not want to wash this with water. Instead, just wipe it with a dry cloth to clean it. Um, do not use if you're allergic to metal. I've never heard of a metal allergy. Interesting. And do not use in areas with skin conditions such as atopic dermatitis, eczema, abscess, or purulent skin infections. Ugh. And then do not use on wounds such as abrasions or bruises. And if you have sensitive skin, perform a test on a small area before using it. External use and massage purpose only. So don't try to massage your inner ear. Also recommend for other body stars such as arms and legs. And due to the heavy weight of the metal, be careful not to drop the massager on the body while using it. Yeah, it's, it's not, it's, it's not that heavy. Let's, you know what, let's just figure out how heavy this is. Have a scale. It is a whopping 135 grams. <laughs> it's not that heavy, but it has a good weight. Like for a roller, it actually has a good weight. I did buy another roller in the past, which is the Jade Roller. I've used it off and on. Um, it feels really nice on your skin because it is nice and cooling, but I haven't used it enough. Why? 
sheer laziness and lack of time. That's it. That's the only reason why. Probably should use a little bit more because I did spend money on it. So the science behind this is that it helps to promote circulation. So it helps to, um, it helps with lymphatic drainage and I guess like water retention. And so it'll, it'll give you the, not illusion, but it will actually make your, you're supposed to make your face look slimmer, which I could use with some lymphatic drainage and some more additional circulation. So it's also help with puffiness under your eyes as well as the dark circles because a lot of times the dark circle is just, it's blood that's there, right? So you want to just kind of move that along like shoo, shoo, shoo. So you're supposed to use this AM and PM and you essentially, according to Avon, you just grip it and roll it upwards at least three times over the indicated areas. So let's first check out my skin. Take a good look at it. So yeah, I do have circles on my eyes for sure. Not too much puffiness, which is good. If this could help with my double chinness, that would be awesome. My skin's pretty decent lately. I mean, I've been using the new, like I've been using the new face wash from Avon, the Rice Water Bright, and that's been really good. Um, right now, all I have on is a little bit of the Power Serum and nothing else. So I guess the first thing I should do is actually reapply my Power Serum just for the sake of doing it. Pat it in. And then I'm going to use my eye cream, my favorite eye cream, and then my day lotion. Okay, so let's try this now. I'm going to start with my VU line. So repeat to roll from the center of your chin to the bottom of your earlobes in an upward and soft pulling motion. So this way. Oh, oh, oh my God. <gasps> oh my God, that's so cool. Two, three. Okay. It kind of like sucks my cheek fat upwards in here. That was such an interesting feeling. Whoa! I want to do it one more time. So like I started with my chin here and I pulled this way. It was like right here, right there, right there, right there, right there. It's like it's like a straw. That is hilarious. It feels kind of cool. Like not cold temperature cool, but huh. Interesting cool. Okay, let's see the other side. Like, you feel like a tightness, and I'm not pushing. I'm just, like, literally pulling three. I'm going to do four, because I did four on the other side. Oh. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, so, so I want to go here and here. Okay. This way. I wonder if I did this way. It's different. This way is definitely a lot softer. Okay, I'm going to do this way because I feel like this way actually has a little bit more like pull tightness to it. So it's one, two. So I went all the way to my temple. Two, three. And the other side. One, three. And then from the corner of my mouth to my earlobe. More fat sucking. Or chubby sucking. Two, three. One. Two, three. That is such an interesting feeling. Oh my gosh! Like now I know. You know what? Now I know what my son feels like when I like chew on his cheeks. I put his cheeks between my lips, in my mouth. And I go. Ah, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> his cheeks are so chubby. This is what that must feel like. He doesn't mind it. He really doesn't. Okay, eye area, eyebrow line, massage from the middle of the forehead to your ears across the tail of eyebrow, across the tail of the eyebrow. Avoid your eye socket and your pupil. So I want to go here, like that. Oh, to my ear, 
two ears across the tail of eyebrows. Yeah, so I'm gonna keep it on my eyebrows. Two, three, one. Oh, this this is actually really therapeutic. Two, oh, three. Oh, I wish my eyebrows would stay up there. Look at that, look at that, look at that lift. Look at that lift, stay up there, stay up there. Okay, I'm just gonna do the other side twice more. Oh, I really like this one. It actually feels like a bit of a scalp massage. That feels really good. Like right here, just I felt like this tension kind of go away. Ooh, forehead to hairline. Okay, well, the thing is, I have a very short forehead, so that pretty much did my forehead too. Massage softly from the center of the forehead towards the hairline. Roll from the center of the forehead towards the temple by section. So yeah, I have a incredibly short forehead. So you see, this already pretty much did it, but I'll do it again. One, two, three. The other side is, oh, my hair doesn't get caught. Okay, that's what I was worried about. Three, one, two, three. Let's do one more. Oh, 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 this is like <laughs> such a good massage. It just, it feels so relaxing in my scalp. Holy. I am so abused by this thing. <laughs> neck and decollete area. Roll from your chin line to the neck up and down. Repeat, roll side to side from clavicle to shoulder line. So I go here, 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 and then here and here. All right, so I go up and down. One, two, three. This is a little weird. Okay, this one I don't find quite as comfortable, but that's okay. One, because I hate things around my neck three and let's do one more one two three what if i do it this way it hurt. nope so i go from my clavicle to my shoulders this feels really awkward oh it releases tough muscle tension oh my god that feels so good that feels so good i also taught dance yesterday so my muscles are pretty sore oh my god one it's like it's a little bit uncomfortable, but after you do it for like the shoulder area right here, cause like there's bone here, obviously. After you do it, it gives you this like nice release of tension. It's so good. And the final one is acupressure for the temples and back of earlobes. What? Back of earlobes here? One, two, three. I don't know if I'm doing this one right. And then temple area. One two, three, one, two, three. That one, I'm not sure if I did right. The body ones, I want to do to experience, but I don't know if I'll do it, actually do it for two weeks. All right, arms from elbow to the armpit. Yeah, I don't know which I'm supposed to pull it because it's a very different experience when you pull up versus when you pull down. I actually feel it better this way. Like when I do it, pulling it this way than, than pushing it that way. Like I feel it's a better pull. Oh, 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 there you go. Oh, oh triceps are sore. Oh, other side. That was really interesting. It's kind of like back in university, my mom got me this fat pinching <laughs> massage. Oh my God, so embarrassing. It was for my arms so that I would have slimmer arms. <laughs> This kind of feels like that. It's called Meetsy. I don't know if they still have it anymore, but I remember she would like basically pinch my fat, my fat cells in my arms and massage it and then wrap it with like this chili oil. And I don't know if it worked, but I mean, my arms are how my arms are. But um, it kind of feels a little bit like that. Less painful, but yeah. But I mean, if it's going to help with the lymphatic drainage, sure, why not, right? or like help retighten the skin because my arms have definitely gotten not as toned since having Nathaniel. Although with the weight he's going, I'm sure I'll tone up again soon because he's a heavy little monkey. Okay, now the other places that you can do it is my waist, chest, and leg. So for your chest, you go, I'm not gonna take my shirt off for this guys. For my chest, you go repeat the roll from the center of your chest as if pressing down on the armpit. So, and it goes both both ways. 
So it's like this way. That kind of tickles. Kind of odd. All right. Waist, you roll up and down. Recommend to the back of the waist as well. So back here. It actually feels like a massager. Actually, this feels really, really, really nice. Of course, when you have a sore back muscles or something. Hey, you guys very rarely ever see me from the waist down. And then my thigh. There. Pants are staying on. Oh my god, that tickles so much. Okay, so for your thigh, you repeat the roll inside of the thigh from the knee to the top of the leg. While doing this, press more strongly during the upward roll. So I pull strong. I think this is upward, and she's holding it this way. So. It's like a tickly pain. Whoa! Very interesting. So I've done every single body part now. That totally took about 10 to 15 minutes. Um, also because I'm learning how to use this. So it's probably taking a little bit longer than normal. It's actually really fun to use, especially as a first time thing. It's just like, I totally was not expecting that like sucking pulling feeling, especially along here. Although I really did enjoy it. Um, you can, I don't know if you can see it, but it does get kind of like, oh, kind of grimy looking because of the products that you use on your face. It kind of obviously is going to collect a little bit on the product here. So you just need to wipe it clean with a dry cloth. I'm going to grab a microfiber cloth a little bit later on. I don't know much of, notice much of a difference right away, although my skin feels warmer, it, which probably means that it de definitely is a lot more circulation. Okay, so let's take a peek. Yeah, so it does feel warmer and my cheeks feel pinker, which looks like a little bit of a flush. So natural blush. Um, my dark circles are still there, but that's okay. I'm going to give this a try for a few more weeks, definitely. But here's the skin. I'll probably try it up here too, just because I always have tension right through here. Overall, it's definitely a really fun product to try. Uh, it's it's really different. I'm actually really surprised how different it was than my jade roller. Like the jade roller, you do roll it up like this, but I don't get that pulling feeling. So if in my mind, if I feel like there's gonna get more results out of doing this, it'll probably be from the. Um, Use activating massager as opposed to a jade roller although i do really like the cooling sensation of the jade roller the squeaking is a little annoying though i think it's just mine because i haven't had any complaints from customers that it squeaks and i've sold several of these already it is pricier it's uh the regular price is 60 dollars. but if you're gonna get a lot of use out of it you don't have to replace it for years and years to come i say get it i will probably continue using this and shoot another video in about two weeks time so that i can see a slightly longer term use how it works out as long as i can be consistent enough and not keep passing out at night when i put nathaniel down for to sleep <laughs> but so make sure if you haven't yet click that subscribe button as well as that little bell icon beside it so you get that video notification and then also if you are interested in seeing our full lineup of products and ch checking out our youth massager as well as reading up about its benefits make sure you do click my easter link down below if you want to become a beauty boss for 2020 and start making extra income online selling our products promoting our products and trying out our products make sure you do once again click the easter link down below click join my team and i'll be here to help you out i will reach out to you i love you guys i'll see you next video bye